it a stick in here? <laughs> So we're back at it again, catching a few pigs. Today we've got myself, John T, Luke and Michael. And there's quite a big bog here. A few pigs have been chilling out of them, so it's a good sign. I reckon there's definitely a pig on the cards for today. Just depends how big it is. We'll catch up with a few when it's a bit lighter, hopefully. So it's just light enough that the rain's starting to come in pretty heavy, which isn't ideal, but... What it is. Jack and the rest of the dogs are down the creek, so we're just gonna work our way down towards them and see if they can pick something up. Quite a bit of pig rooting round up on the other side over there. Dogs just headed out over that ridge. There's a wee bit of pig rooting down in there. Oh, there's a little bit on the other side too, not too much though. So the dogs are just shot into this little gut here. We've had a big ball belt up in there before, so it's pretty promising. Down. Fuck. Fuck. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Good dogs, everybody. So, we got the boar. It's a good boar. Jonty got in there and shot it in the front shoulder. And then, oh, we had it bailed up in that gorse up there and then it just broke. She was all over. But we were sitting about 20 metres away from it from when they started bailing, singing songs and shit. Oh, there's a, there's a possum there too. <laughs> it's good, we're going to get this and carry it out to that bit over there and hopefully Michael can get the motorbike <laughs> out of the mud. So after a bit of a closer look, Jack's got a bit of a skin rip under there. It looks pretty bad, but it's not too bad. He'll live. He'll be fine. He always seems to get way too close to the bail up. The old camera's a bit fogged up, but I'm going to get a few photos and get it out there. Michael's just over on the track over there coming to get us. Yeah, boy. I thought that was your, I thought that was your mouth, but nah, it's half your face ripped off. Couch tonight. This little thing, or big hooky ball. For reference, that's my shoe. No. <laughs> oh yeah, no, nah, we'll do. Oh. It actually looks mad dog on you. Scratch that. It's not 120. It's 220. Right, <coughs> I'll just grab the gun. Yeah, I'll just grab the gun. Oh, chuck us a gun. Uh, pigs on, and we're out. Is that up? Hold this. Like a gorge. So we're just walking down here. There's a, <laughs> there's a couple of deer over there. So I'm just trying to shoot a duck with the 44. But we're just having a look for a couple of pigs. 
again. Rain stopped for the moment, which is pretty handy. Shoot the cow. <laughs> Couple deer. Oh, look at that stag right there. Holy. Didn't see him. No, you can't shoot him. <laughs> That's a doozy stag. So we saw quite a few deer then, maybe 12, and then a good probably 14 point stag. But we'd, we're not too worried about shooting them because we got the dogs with us and then that just teaches them that we're not chasing pigs anymore. But there's a few around, maybe two spikers, stag, and maybe ten hinds. Serious deer coming out of that face. He's about to shoot one. Look at that stag. They just move it. Yeah, there's a lot of deer. It's dug out the right side too. The cow's just shitting down there. Here we go. Oh. Wait. No, Don't. he's missed it. Don't it's, drop the stag. There's deer hitting out the right. There he is, on the skyline. The Michael just shot a hind in there. It's a pretty big hind. You'll be able to carry it out and get it up to the bike and a bit of venison. It's pretty good. John is just carrying out the back legs. I've got back stakes. The deer was in primo condition, so it's going to be a tasty eater. Pig. Back at the truck, just loading up the bike, getting home for lunch. Oh, well, we're just going to put the dogs away and go and have some lunch. Got the pig on the back there. And sweet, cheers for watching. We'll see you next video.